Today, I'm going to talk about five tips for beginner photographers, so tune in. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back. You good? This is Hyun Min Jeon from HMJ Photography. And today, I want to talk about five tips for beginner photographers to improve your photography game. So, don't go anywhere. Number one, always have your camera with you. Whenever and wherever you go, always take your camera with you. Because if you don't have your camera, you can't take any pictures. <laughs> my wife sometimes tells me that my cameras are like my mistresses. But no, 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 no. She's wrong. Because my cameras are a part of me. It's my eyes, it's my brains. And I just need to take my camera with me all the time. To be honest, I feel very uncomfortable if I don't have my cameras with me. So, take your camera wherever you go. Number two, use prime lenses. I'm not trying to say that zoom lenses are bad. What I'm trying to say is that when you use zoom lenses, it might not help you grow as a beginner photographer than as much as using prime lenses. When you use prime lenses, you really get to understand how much of the area your lens can cover. Also, prime lenses tend to have smaller, or in other words, brighter f-stops, so it helps you understand the depth of field and also how bokeh works. Prime lenses tend to be smaller than zoom lenses, so again, it helps you carry your camera around everywhere. Number three, walk around and turn around. You don't have to go to fancy places to take nice pictures. Just walk around anywhere. It can even be inside your apartment. Just remember to turn around frequently because same places can look differently when you look at it from different point of view. Which leads to number four. Find something special and something that most people think of it as nothing. Anyone can take cool pictures of place, person, or an object that most people think of it as cool. Your skills will really shine if you can take interesting pictures of something that most people regard it as boring or dull. Use your creativeness and think how you can make something look interesting or unique. Look from below, look from above, look from left, look from right, and find that interesting angle. Number five, learn from other photographers and artists. To become a great chef, you need to eat a lot of good and a lot of bad food so that you would know what is good and what is bad. It's exactly the same with photographers. You need to take a look at a lot of good photos and a lot of bad photos. Come on, you have internet. Just Google names like Fan Ho. Platon, any label bits, and not only photographers, but also artists like Edward Hopper, Van Gogh, Vermeer. In my case, my father is an artist, so I grew up looking at his artworks. And when you look at those photos or artworks, study. Study their light, study their colors. And when you like something so much, try to recreate them. You will learn so much from this. Well, that's it for today, guys. At the end of the day, what's really important is your willingness to improve your photography and your love towards photography. Every week on Thursday, I post videos about photography and cameras in English and in Japanese. So please like, subscribe and share. It will support me so much. Until next time.